the congratulations on order for the eye and the tooth. Tooth and the eye. Oh. Hey, you still on for drinks tonight? Yeah, I wouldn't miss it. No, oh, someone say drinks. Ah, uh, yes, Lily and Philly have got a date. Mm. Would you call it a date? If someone forced me to label it, yeah. Mm. I want to talk to you about the way you're treating Drew. Sorry? You need to do better. He knows something's up and he's blaming himself. Okay, you don't need to worry about what goes on between me and Drew. Except that I do. Because he tells me about it. Because for some reason he's chosen me as a sounding board. Okay, well tell him not to do that. Oh, but this isn't easy. I know. Then just please. Give him less to talk to me about it and stop making it harder than it needs to be. It must be awful for you having to be his counsellor with all the crap we're going through. And I just... I just wanted to say that my feelings for you were real, are uh, real. And that ending, whatever this is or was, is really hard. And I'm ready to make things right and move on. I want that too. OK, well, what the hell? Drew dragged me along. Oh, but I need space. I thought you were trying to move on. I told you, he made me come. I don't want to be here. And yet here you are. Please, leave me alone. <gasps> well, I think I could. Well, you definitely could. Cool under pressure. Yeah, good with your hands. Right then, hot shot. Retrain, we'll see you in theatre. Uh, I just, uh, I don't know if I've quite got enough ego. What are you trying to say? That we all think that we're hot shit? Some of you are. Are you following me now? Looks like it. Why? I don't know. No. Can you go? It's all right. We can have it. Go. Now. But it doesn't need to be like this. Harbour, if you don't stop, I will report you to Esther. What? If you don't leave me alone, I'll have you up for harassment. I'm sorry. I wasn't thinking. Well, I was out of line. It's all a mess, but that was me panicking. I'm not going to report you. Thank you. I'm, I'm sorry about how all of this has turned out. Yeah, same. And I promise I won't bother you anymore, for real, this time. I still care about you and I don't want to make things harder. I know. I care about you too. Beautiful. Mm. Maybe we should call this whole thing off and just stay home, the two of us. Okay, tell me what you really think. Well, I really want to play the game. Right. We're in agreement. Yeah, now I'm attacking you. What? But, yep, I'll just, I'll take these guys. Uh, we've had a truce since the start of the game. All fair in love and war, babe, and this, this is war. Oh, she got you good. So you just lied to my face. I'm just... That's bullshit! Harper, and what else are you lying to me oh, about? Okay, can you just dial it back? Because there's please. something, right? There is something you're no, not telling no, me. No, there is not. Stop hiding it, I'm Harper. I'm not hiding anything. You liar! Well, come on. We need all the help we can get, right? Or do you not believe in luck? Some make it and some don't. No stupid good luck Charlie ever saved anyway. Drew, what is his problem? Are you all right? Can you stop asking me that? You and I both know that you don't actually care. We know that's not true. Just go check on Drew. He's the one that needs you, remember? Not me. Mate! Hey. Didn't think you were coming. Well, Harper managed to get an 11th hour babysitter, so... Yeah, sure, I didn't know you had ink. That's because it's on my ass. <laughs> oh, yuck, in that case, nice. <laughs> no, what is it? I love tattoos. Well, I wanted Harper. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, but he ended up with Kate. <laughs> Wait, how did that happen? Okay, now I have to see. No, no, you do not want to see it. It is horrible. It's not nice and cute like yours. <gasps> you too, Dark Horse. You've seen Phil's tattoo. You girls are closer than I thought. <laughs> Why, where's yours? It's uh, private. Ooh, okay. What can I say? I like to strut my stuff in the woman's locker room. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't know what I was thinking. And now it's a locker room flasher? There's going to be an HR memo about me. <laughs> an exhibitionist. Oh, anything for attention. But seriously. Yeah, I know. Thank you. You dodged a bullet. I've been giving you so much grief about something that's both of our fault. I'm sorry. You've been hurting. So have you. You keep reaching out and I keep batting you away. You hate it. Yeah, I can see that. 
Now you're trying to look out for me and make things right. I want us to at least be friends. Then I keep pushing you away and playing stupid games. Well, like I said, you've been hurting and that's on me. But it's just us now. And I can be real with you. No, please don't. Hopper. No, I... I can't. Hopper. How can I help? I just wanted to say I'm sorry. Oh, can we not do this at work, please? I was out of line last night. But I also can't stop thinking about you. Phil, stop. Still mad at me? I'm not mad at you. It just can't happen again. I'm sorry, okay? I don't know what I was thinking or not thinking. Let's just move on. I really like Billy, you know? And I feel like I've taken a sledgehammer to my entire life. No. I have three beautiful kids and a husband who loves me, a husband who's had a horrible year and who keeps lashing out emotionally because he knows something's wrong but he doesn't know what. He thinks it's his fault and, and it's killing me. Well, some secrets have to stay secret. I do. I think maybe you're at a place now where you're looking for something more. There isn't a third person. Because after Madonna, I... Yeah, I can't handle dishonesty like that. For sure. I don't know how you can say you love someone and then lie to their face, you know? I'm sorry that happened to you. Just tell the truth, always. How hard is that? Please don't be mad, but I think I need to tell them. What? No, no, you can't be serious. There's no need, okay? We're finished, you made that quite clear there. He knows something is not right, he can sense it. Well then just let him. A feeling is different from confirmation. He can think what he likes. Phil, it is hurting him. Okay, I didn't want to have to do this. Harper, but you're forcing my hand. If you tell Drew, I'm gonna tell everyone that you led me on. But I didn't. It doesn't matter. You're a consultant. Harper, think about how your affair with a junior doctor is going to look to the rest of the world. You ruined my life and I ruined yours. So you're blackmailing me now. You're unbelievable. Who should we tell first? Hmm? The nurses? They'll get the word out to every department pretty quick. See how long your reputation lasts? How could you be so cruel? Then I'll be kind. You say nothing, I say nothing. Got it? Got it. Good. work that could be filled. Don't answer it. It could be an emergency. Sorry about last night. Are you? Yes. Are you trying to mess with me? I needed Drew's help. Not everything's about you, Jesus. Well, we were trying to have a night in, together. Great. Yeah, I can't wait to hear about it. Just stay away from us, Phil. We work together. Me and your deluded husband. And yeah, you're right. He does think it's all his fault. We're done here. Oh, yeah. We're done. I don't know what I was thinking. Oh, believe me, the feeling is mutual. Drew deserves better. You okay? I can't keep lying to him. Harper. It's breaking me. It's breaking us. What, and you don't think telling him isn't just going to make everything worse? Did I do this to him? I'm irresistible. You didn't stand a chance. Don't. Okay, sorry. Look, just focus on your family. It's what you want, isn't it? I just can't get away from all these lies. It's in the past. As easy as that? Can be. Lucky you. It's called getting over it. I've done something really stupid. Oh, babe. Like, really, like, life ruining, family destroying, regret it for the rest of your life kind of stupid. You can tell me. The feelings weren't stupid. They were real. Okay, so what we're talking about, you had an affair? But it's over. I hate it, I hate that I feel like this. I haven't been myself for months. I, it's all I think about and it is killing me. I promise you won't judge me. I cross my heart. Harper. So Drew has no idea or valet? No one. Wow. And it all just might explode at some point, so I'm gonna need someone in my corner. You've got my back, right? I mean, you sleep with your boss's wife. I fell in love with the wrong person. You know all about that. How did it happen? Where'd you even hook up? Oh, I, I can't. Oh my God, Phil, you guys went away together. The bat, the earthquake. I can't do this. I thought you were gonna be able to help me, but you just want the goss. No, I don't, okay? I am sorry. I wanna help, what do you need? How do I stop my head from exploding? You need to face facts. Is the affair over? Yes. Is it really over? Like, never gonna happen again? No. And does Harper know this? Yes. 
And can you move on carrying the secret? You need to get away. A away? Yeah. Go on a solo retreat. Clear that messy head of yours. No, I've got my priority sauce now. Yeah? Yeah, I'm putting myself first. You been doing that before? I am focusing on what makes me happy, and that's where you come in. I'm glad I made the cut. Sure did. Well, then they can pay the power bills. Everybody's sky high. I can chip him. Uh, 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 uh. You're not a flatmate? Is he? No, I'm not. But he'll be hanging out quite a bit. Oh, you guys are so adorable. Don't you think? I don't, actually. Um, Drew's working. All right, then. Let's go. Well, probably have to release the babysitter, right? You know it. See you later. You scared her off. There is a crowd. Yeah, I like having you to myself, but Harper well, needs... Well. But before you go for dinner tonight, you better think long and hard about what love really means. I was going out of my mind. I had to talk to someone. What if she tells Drew? She won't. You're playing games. I am not. Yeah, you've got nothing to lose. I'm married with three children. Well, maybe you should have thought about that before you hooked up with some unhinged slutty surgeon who made you feel young again. Okay, can you please keep your voice down? You don't get to control me. Well, actually, I'm the head of ED, so this kind of affects the workplace. There it is. I'm just supposed to back off whenever you say, shut up like a good girl, Phil, right? you need to see the bigger picture. I am, of my life with Billy. What? Oh, right, and why did he leave? Can you look me in the eye this time? Okay, we did talk about Coach Owen and he got triggered. I knew it. Harper, you had no right to treat that patient and you know it. I'm sorry. Don't ever lie to me again. You okay? Yeah, yeah, she's been like that all day. With everyone or just you? Everyone, I think. What's going on? What the hell was that? Was Philly? He was out of line. So you blow up at him in front of everyone? Sorry, it's, it's none of your business, actually, Phil. Actually, it is because Philly's my partner. Okay, um, personal and professional. Yeah, I'm not the one that crossed that line, you did. What are you talking about? You just can't stand to see me happy. Okay, I'm. Um, Sorry, I really didn't mean to hurt Billy. Just me. Why did you do that? You're moving on with your life. You're in love with a great guy and... Yeah, you've, and you've got a husband. I ruined all that. What? He won't talk to me. He won't... touch me and I just I don't know what to do. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's okay. You need it. <laughs> what? So you're okay now? Fine for a moment. I don't mean this isn't helping and it's not fair on you, so... I can handle myself. You shouldn't have to. I'm not your problem, okay? You've always got me. again. What? They kissed. Just the once. Drew and Nicole have had a thing going on. I mean, not like a full-blown affair, just to actually don't know what. Wow. Well, yes, yeah, so don't you understand? This changes everything for us. What? Well, it just means that the scales are kind of balanced now. He cheated, you cheated, so everyone's good to go? No, I just think it's good for you to know so you can move on with Lily. Poor Lily. What's happened? I can't look him in the eye. No, you, you can now because you're, you're free of me. You're free of us. Because Drew had a flank. No, because I know how to fix my marriage now. I know where it's broken and it's got nothing to do with you. At least chuck a pawn or something. Maybe. I don't want to do that. I just... I want to move on. Seriously? Let's just draw a line in the sand. Okay? Start fresh. Sorry, Nana Whitley, didn't realise you needed a cup of tea on a lie down. Did you call me Nana? Come on, Harper, don't be boring. Right in the tips, please. please. That must be too much. Mwah. Sorry. What for? Poking my eyes in. Oh, it's fine. Phil, um, yeah. I just wanted to say I really like Lily for you. I think you guys are great together. Did it hurt to say that? Nah, just maybe a little bit. Do you want to open up more? So we have.
have no secrets from each other. Yeah, I'd like that too. I think things are getting serious. Okay, that's great. I mean, I've told you, I think you guys are good together, so go for it. I can't if I'm not honest with him. No. He's important to me. It'll, it'll just hurt him. That's a chance I have to take. I can't take that chance with Drew. You can. No, I can't. It's time. No. Look, I know you don't want to do this, but you have to tell the truth. Really? Tell the truth about what? It's private, um... In this case, I think I need to know. Bullying in the workplace. Who's getting bullied? We don't want to take it any further. No, you just said you want to tell the truth. Who were you going to talk to? The truth is, Harper has been hassling me and singling me out for a while now, and I'm sick of it. Oh? Yeah, I'm really sorry, Phil. I had no idea I was doing that. Thanks. Uh, conflict resolved? Yeah, for now. How is Vili? Don't know. I've been hiding from him. Don't do that. He'll get sus. Oh, he's going to ask questions about the bullying. <laughs> yeah, could you not have thought of something else? Like what? I don't know. Anything. Patient management gone wrong? Oh, I'm sorry. My cover story wasn't good enough. Well, Drew didn't believe it. He thought it was funny. You told him? I had to. Great. Another lie. How many more, Harper? Well, this is the last one because we're never going to talk about this ever again. Oh, you've decided that, have you? One of us needs to start making some smart decisions around here. Is my going to say anything? She's not an issue. How do you know? But you're just going to have to trust me, okay? Phil, how can I trust you? You could blow this whole thing open at any minute. I won't. Let's just delete the past, okay? Whatever happened between us, it doesn't exist. Very good. Thank you. Just you, me, and bring your toothbrush. So now you have time for me. Yeah, sorry, just everything with Harper, but it's all sorted now. It is? Yeah, seems that way. What if you guys have another incident? Won't happen. How do you know? Because we squashed it for good. on for that osteotomy this afternoon. Missed the message. Oh. From your cleaner. Bill. Drew, um... How long? Drew. How long? A couple of months. How long? Okay, three months. I tried to stop it, I did. Genius surgeon. Drew, I'm so, I'm so sorry. So you're in love? No. I've read the text. It was a mistake and it's over. Oh, well, that makes it okay then. You pick on the weak or the vulnerable. Harper's not weak. She knows what her mind is and that's what I wanted to be like. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Look, I didn't know what was going on at first. I just... You just had to jump on that wrecking ball? No. You did? I didn't mean to hurt anyone. Didn't mean to fall in love? Yeah, I didn't think that was going to happen. But it did. I fell in love with Harper. I'm sorry. I told him I loved you. Why would you say that? Because I'm sick of the secrets. If we want to move on, we have to get it all out there. So you're just kicking him while he's down? So what did you say? That there were no feelings there? I didn't rub it in his face. You played loose with the truth. Well, you can't even speak to your patient. How do you expect to operate on them? That's not what I'm saying. Perhaps you should just take a step back from the theatre altogether. What? You heard me. You can't do that. I'll go to Esther. Go on, then. Tell Esther how you slept with my wife while pretending to be my friend and colleague. So you're going to punish me forever? Win back my trust. Then I'll have you back in the hour. I wasn't thinking, who does when they fall in love? So, so you fell in love with Harper before you did anything physical? Well... No. No. For how long? A couple of months. 
Nay, nay, I were in a bad way. I had a miscarriage and I was vulnerable. Really? That's how it started, crying on Harper's shoulder. Okay, she was there and she was hot and I couldn't resist. Is that what you want to hear? Thanks for being honest. Then it became more than that. But it's over. You really like him, don't you? I do. But he shouldn't even know. You guys should be happy and out there having fun. I had to tell him before Drew did. I mean, no one should know. We should have taken it to our graves. Why couldn't we do that? Because you didn't delete the damn texts. Oh, right, so this is my fault. First rule of playing around, delete the comms trail. You'd know. The cleaner? What were you thinking? You used to think that was cute. Yeah, well, none of this is cute anymore. Wow, at least we agree on something. 